Time to fly on Christmas Eve. So I fully intended to start this video a lot sooner, but there's a lot of chaos that we're gonna get to. I just wanna let you guys know though that the airport is probably the most dead I've ever seen it. I mean, I have a small airport here in Rochester, but um, this is wild. <laughs> I was honestly so surprised at how dead the airports were overall. We had a connection in Atlanta, we went to the lounge, and my movie choice for my flights was Gone with the Wind. I am a sucker for old movies. This is the B Lounge. If you want to see more, I have a tour of this lounge, the Sky Club, on my channel. Pretty good food selection. And why not start off the trip with champagne? We made it to Miami. We had to take an Uber up to Fort Lauderdale. Long story short, we had to move some flights around because of all those cancellations. But how beautiful is this during Christmas time? I absolutely loved it. All the decorations, the lights. I'm a sucker for Christmas lights. Absolutely beautiful. So we're staying at the W Fort Lauderdale Beach Resort. I'm working on an article that should now be in the comments section if you check down there on the best hotels to stay at in Fort Lauderdale, especially for pre and post cruise. This is the W. I will say overall, it is not my recommendation. And it kills me to say that because I had very, very high hopes. I feel like I'm cheating on the Hilton. Like this is beautiful. I love it and I can't wait to explore more of it. And I look at the Hilton next door, which I love. Um, for those of you that are new, it's on my blog, and the Conrad next door is wonderful, but like the guest service at that Hilton is like second to none. Um, it's amazing, but so far the W has been beautiful and wonderful. Man, I know I'm using awful lighting in here, but I just finished my COVID health screening, or not screening, test with the Binax home kits. Jeff's getting ready to do his, so you're gonna see some behind the scenes. Now I know you guys heard me say that this was not my favorite, just so you know, our test results were good. More cruise vlogs to come. The hotel's beautiful, it's on the beach, it's wonderful, but honestly, there was a lot of cleanliness issues with the room. And for how much this hotel cost, you really shouldn't be having those kind of issues. We even got moved to two different rooms because in the first room there wasn't a shower curtain and whatnot, and lights falling out of the ceiling and just dirty, unfortunately. However, the meal, the Mexican restaurant here, on point, would recommend that 10 out of 10. The food was amazing. Make sure you check out my channel for more travel tips and videos and my blog for more recommendations. I will see you next time. Thanks for watching.